the next one we're gonna work the self defense from the one arm trap. We did a uh, we do it this way so you can see it. Yeah, come on. So we did double unders and then we did double overs when he has like both my arms in and then we did one where he had just one. Okay, so we'll review the one where it's just one where I'm stuck in. So here I always want to base here and control that wrist. Okay, and this one's gonna uppercut. I'm gonna step out to this side. Okay, so if I just try to uppercut and throw him from here, I don't have enough leverage. Okay, so I step and I make a little bit of space in between us here. Okay, so I'm gonna keep my shoulder tight to my ear as you roll it out. Boom, I'm gonna follow him to the back. And now I have the back position. Okay, so he goes again, drop just one arm. I wanna control the same side wrist. If I control this one, it's not enough leverage. Okay, so same side wrist that's under, that's stuck. I take a step and I just wanna give a little shrug and an uppercut it turns into an overhand boom, and then I get that grip, okay? So that's the first one. And then part two of that is if he starts to counter it, okay? So say I step out this way, and I'm trying to go out to this direction, but see how his head right now is on my left shoulder? Yeah, now I have the space to get under it, but if he switches and puts his head to my right shoulder, yeah, now I can't go under because he put his weight on me yeah, yeah. on this side. So as hard as I try, I won't be able to do it. I might be able to get like a throw, but I want to just keep it nice and simple. Okay, so I'm trying, trying, trying. From here, I'm going to step out now with my left and check the hip with my far hand here. And I slide out the back side. That's good. Okay, so there's always a, always a way out. Okay, so this time he has my, my right arm. Okay, so I'm here. I go and I step to make space, but he switches his head, yeah. So now he closes that. Okay, now I switch my feet. Okay, so I do like a little V-step. Let's back up a little bit so I can see it. Got the camera. Yeah, so on this side, I step out the front leg. Boom, to make space. But now he's heavy on this side, I can't. So I switch my feet. Then here I'm gonna follow to the inside. Now I have the underhook, and just like what we just worked right now, it's a throw by. It's all connected, bro. <laughs> Turn this way a little bit. Yeah, get this so, here, I try and really go for this one. Then he switches. So from here, I'm just gonna go to the back. Okay. And then there's we can kind of just play back and forth like that. So say he grabs me for the original one. Yeah. So say I go for this. Oh, I'm trying to shoot it. Yeah. Now he knows that there's space there. He's gonna switch his head back. Oh my, go back to the original. One. Okay, so depending on where his head's at is where I escape. Got it? One, two, three. Boom. 